Running is really my main focus. Simple, you know, you just throw on your gear and you go out for a run. I was approaching my 50th birthday and thought, what's next? It was New Year's Day. It was a cold, frosty morning. I wanted to walk and Steve wanted to run. There was a guy driving a car who lost control, ploughed straight up the bank um, and unfortunately into me. I realised that there was something happening up on, the, on this corner. Um, so I thought, oh, I'll give Steve a ring just to check, um, you know, just to tell him not to come past that corner. And I looked at his location on, on the phone just to check and I realised it was up at that corner. So I thought he probably might be helping someone because that's the kind of guy he is. And I went back up there and then I spoke to the policewoman and then I realised it was Steve. So Reboa stands for Resuscitative Endovascular Balloon Occlusion of Aorta and it's a technique that we've been using at London's Air Ambulance for about 10 years now. So prior to this intervention many patients would die on scene because they had what we call non-compressible haemorrhage. So Reboa was brought in to try and find a temporary measure which would allow us to reduce or control bleeding temporarily until we can get the patient to a hospital, a major trauma centre. So there's a high chance that without the capability to deliver Reboa, Steve perhaps wouldn't have survived. So I was in um, intensive care for four days, uh, stayed in the hospital for three weeks. Then our life just changed so much, having to feed, clean him, clothe him. When you realise how your life has been saved, that motivates you to make the most of your life. So I run now. I just feel an amazing gratitude to the Air Ambulance for, for what they've done to, to save me. I get to see my family every day and I'm thankful for that.